Hi guys, today we're going to try some homemade liquid nitrogen. Um, really all it is is dry ice with rubbing alcohol, um, but it's supposed to work. It, I'm pretty sure it's not going to work just as good as liquid nitrogen, but we're going to try it out. Um, so we're going to try to freeze a couple things, got some gummy bears, some flowers, and we're going to smash it and see what happens. Okay, so here we have the dry ice in a little tub, and we're going to open up this rubbing alcohol. And we're going to pour it in there and see what happens. Wow, look at that. Let's see. Look at all that smoke. There it goes. Fizzing up. A little bit more in there. There we go. Let's these tongs and swish it around a little bit. Look at it bubbling up. So we're going to give it a couple minutes and let it freeze up here. And we're going to see how it works. Okay, so we're going to throw some gummy bears in there. See what that happens. Some gummy worms. And it looks really cold. Look at that block of ice still in there. Let's see. Let's try a flower while it's in there too. Oh, look at that. That's instantly freezing. Wow. Look at that. I guess that works pretty good. That's cold. Keep it in there for a couple seconds. Look at that. That's just crumpling. Ooh, that's cold on my finger. Wow. It's almost like eggshells. Longer, see what happens. It doesn't really take long at all. Look at that. Wow. That's pretty cool. Let's see how these gummy worms are doing. Look at that. Hard to rock. Let's see how that works. Move that over. Look at that. Wow. I just probably shouldn't be doing that with the camera there, just shaking it all over, but it's working. I mean, that's that's pretty impressive. Some gummy bears here. Look at that. That is rock hard. Look at that. That is just hard as it can be. Here, let me hold the camera so I'm not shaking it around. But as you can see, look at that. Hard as a rock. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool. Let's see, we got some more in here. It's pretty frozen solid, and it's, it's actually still going, but it's that it works. Um, if you can't find liquid nitrogen and you're trying to do some kind of experiment with it, but you can't afford it or you can't find it, um, get some rubbing alcohol, get some dry ice. I mean, it's not very expensive, it's, and it works fairly good. I mean, all of this is rock hard. I mean, look at this. That is, God, look at that, that is pretty impressive, I like that. So, there you have it, dry ice, rubbing alcohol, makes homemade liquid nitrogen, and it's pretty good. It's pretty fun to play with, too. Look at this flower, let's stick that back in there for a little bit. Let's see, rub that in here. Let that sit there for a little bit. So that is pretty cool. Alrighty, guys. Well, I'm going to be doing a lot more videos like this and some different things. We're going to do some testing of different materials and different, um, just different things. There's some kind of random stuff. But if you enjoy watching this video, please subscribe. Please leave comments if you want to see anything else in particular. Um, and subscribe, like I said, and enjoy.